guys are going to go back in time. Yeah! You are going to have the most excellent adventure through history. The technology we have dreamed of for generations is finally here. We have transcended time to bring you the ultimate traveling experience, to witness fist and the birth of modern life on Earth. Come with us on a journey into the land of the dinosaurs, where no human has ever existed before. Welcome to the Mesozoic Experience. The Mesozoic lasted about 180 million years. It was a time of climatic, tectonic and evolutionary activity. During this exciting time, the supercontinent Pangaea gradually drifted into the continents we have today, resulting in speciation. This era was exceptionally warm, and dominated by reptiles. The Mesozoic era is divided into three time periods, the Triassic, Jurassic, and Cretaceous. The Triassic era occurred between 251 and 199 million years ago, following the Permian extinction, which killed 96% of all marine life and 70% of all terrestrial life. During this time, the continents begin to divide and the depopulated marine life diversifies. Reptiles dominate the period, but mammal-like reptiles evolve into small mammals in the late Triassic. The end Triassic extinction resulted in the death of 76% of marine species, and many large reptiles. This event is thought to have helped the dinosaurs become the dominant land animals on Earth during the Jurassic period. The Triassic would be a great educational adventure to any willing to go. The Jurassic period lasted 54 million years, and was dominated by dinosaurs. The continents continued to move apart, and the first birds evolved. Large herbivores like the Stegosaurus were preyed upon by smaller carnivores. Modern-looking sharks roamed the seas, and the flora consisted of ferns and conifer forests. Mammals were still very small when the period ended with a minor extinction. The Cretaceous period ended the Mesozoic era. By the end of this period, the continents are very close to where they are today. During this time, we see the first flowering plants as well as butterflies, ants, snakes and bees. We also see feathered dinosaurs like the Tyrannosaurus rex and Triceratops. The famous end Cretaceous extinction occurred 65 million years ago and killed off all terrestrial dinosaurs except for birds. The extinction was caused by an asteroid that hit Earth in the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico, forming what is now called the Chicxulub Impact Crater. Non-avian dinosaurs, pterosaurs and large marine reptiles, died out. But many groups of organisms, such as flowering plants, snails, clams, amphibians, lizards, snakes, crocodilians, and mammals sailed through the Cretaceous-Tertiary boundary, with few or no apparent extinctions at all. The extinction of the dinosaurs made way for the rise of the mammals. As large predators went extinct, they left niches open for the lower trophic level to fill, the age of the dinosaurs ended, and the meek inherited the earth. Aruba, Jamaica, ooh, I wanna take you. Bermuda, Bahama, come on pretty mama. Key Largo, Montego, baby, why don't we go? Jamaica, off the floor of the key.